guys that wasn't recording on <laughs> oh, audio. Shit. But yeah. Um hello everyone. I'm doing this intro again because I, I forgot to unmute the audio on OBS. Isn't that fun? But yeah, we're here for more flash. Uh I'm very excited to see Ronnie return either on this episode or the next. Or the next. Soon he'll return. I'm excited gonna be for right. gold face. Goldface. I hope no, I imagine they're saving Goldface for the finale because he, of course, is the bigger <laughs> villain. <laughs> Imagine, <laughs> <no>. <laughs> well, it's one thing to fight against Ronnie, which is like a character who's been in the show for since season one and who has a close attachment to a lot of the main characters, and Goldface, who's Goldface, because Goldface is much better. So, yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited for Ronnie to return and be some evil bitch ass cunt. Basically, <laughs> I'd guarantee you they're gonna do um, what was his name? The fake Jay Garrick thing again with Caitlin. It's gonna be basically that evil Ronnie from another universe. Um, yeah, I <laughs> Im imagine so. Good, yeah. What's his real name? It began with H. What? Who's real name? The actor? Zooms. Oh. Uh. Hunter Zolomon. Yes, that's a the most obvious yeah. twist in the fucking world. <laughs> I mean, yeah, the show is not known for having its surprising twists. <laughs> To be honest, it, it literally went. Why? Why don't you have a doppelganger? And he's like, I don't know. <laughs> Goldface, Universe Two, Goldface. All the gold faces. Crisis on Goldface. Crisis on Goldface. <laughs> <laughs> Crisis on Infinite Goldfaces. Anyway, uh, let us yes, watch please. Episode Nine. It's a building with tense music. Almost at the goal. Oh, it's uh, the Steel Force oh, guy. Oh, this fag. Our hair gets uglier every episode. Hey, check yourself you wreck yourself. That <laughs> is how you explain sex. <laughs> for protection. Is she gonna mention the fork that disappeared? Forgetting yeah. things. That might be dementia. For instance, there was this <laughs> <laughs> oh, do we need a flashback? It was the last scene of the last episode. Yeah. My memory it. lasts for yeah, one week at least, I, I guess, you sure you show. Me. At least Ages of S.H.I.E.L.D. does like the um, quick, like, recap thing yeah, that you could skip. Well, I mean, this show and does show, but it didn't this- and it, then it hasn't to all episodes this season. Of, it's weird. Of a train station, and for some reason I feel like you were there. Forget we had an appointment in the books. It was to me, because I remember something like that. Hey, Wait, um, no, you're not just uh, gonna leave, right? What? Catch a time it's like, I, I would've remembered it, don't worry. Idea. <laughs> but I intend to find out. <laughs> like, what the fuck is this oh, whole subplot, oh, virus? I'm picking up mutations. Well, that sounds bad. No shit. Oh, thanks, oh, really? It could mean a lot of things. Tell you what, I'm gonna go hit up my four sibs to see if they can help four me figure this out. Four sibs? I hate this character four so sibs. much. I don't know what this is yet, so for now, just chill. She's gonna tell Barry. As soon as I find out what's up, I'll come find you. I'm gonna ask my four sibs the ones that have nothing to do with time. Delta. Iris basically has the equivalent of time cancer. I mean, Which makes sense, because Iris is cancer on the show. I was gonna Fuck. make that fucking joke. So loud. Yeah, I had to <laughs> lower the audio. I can't hear any of you when the intro uh, comes on. Yeah, I had to lower the audio. Thing? When editing is always a nightmare. I was just basically saying how Iris has time cancer because yeah. she's a cancer on the show. Where's Caitlyn? Why are they just having Frost here? She's fucking running. Cheating on, uh, what's the guy's name? Uh, where's Marcus, isn't it? Uh, uh, who, who cares? Yeah, Marcus. Marcus is going to oh, become Sky Oh, here, is getting away. That sounds I'm weird, I'm doesn't it? Truth, You'd expect so, think... Frost to do that with her boyfriend, not Caitlyn. Okay. Chester? Is he remembering when he almost burned down his parent, his friend's parents' house? <laughs> <laughs> That's such... They actually... We did know something. Meta is gonna alert us as soon as there's any rapid drops in barometric anomalies anywhere in the city. We won't know where our baddie actually is until flames on. Right? Well, no, the Barry's a speed, so. hit, Yeah. Be fast enough to get there in time. Exactly. We can end this. Yo, <laughs> I mean, I'm sure Barry wouldn't run there and just just stop to talk with the person. Mm, mm, no, oh, that's not cool. like him. <laughs> not nah, Sue. Yeah. The moment I said. Stop to talk, man. We could spring to slitter. Why is Sue her? Uh, I don't know. I have no what, idea. Who this uh, I'm, is. I'm, I'm, I miss Ralph. Uh, Ralph was great. I miss Ralph too. But he said racist statements about, like years ago, so kind of. Hurt. Yeah, so fuck him. No one has made racist jokes, right, Jeff? Have you ever said the N word? <laughs> 
one's doing all the work. Fuck's sake. <laughs> right, I'll just spit up my cup. Fuck. Coast City, we own a string of country, the fun part well, about racist jokes is knowing that you don't get hurt by them because you hurt the blacks. All right, then. I'm gonna cut that off. <laughs> no, I expect you to make it like really loud so everyone can pay attention. Turns out there's folks all over the place with latent meta genes. Yeah, they're probably. Hey, they have a new, they have a new justification for meta humans being created in season eight. Can you just stop, yeah, you please? They all have it. There... <laughs> Turns out there's a bunch of crazy, wacky scientists all over the world who made their own particle accelerator <laughs> that exploded. Eobard Khan replicated himself through all the world to make other particle accelerators. <laughs> He's slowly becoming like the syndrome of this universe when everyone's super, no, no one, one will, will be. be. <laughs> we, we paid no attention to that scene. I generally have no idea what the purpose of it was. I did not. Uh, it's all right. It was something to do with Iris, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> Dave, we're going to expand the West Coast through the matters. They're investigating. Ah, this music's loud. That black fire. All right. That's funny. Okay then. Not the dead body, Ronnie's alive. Too late. <laughs> <My time. No. laughs> the way that was said. <laughs> <laughs> also, Barry could just said to a flash time, why doesn't he? Um Oh yeah, uh, flash that time. Was I forgot only he had a that thing power. in season four. Yeah, he he had the flash time episode where he stopped time and then he never used that power again. Parker Stefano, she teaches classes here at the studio. She don't anymore, Barry. <laughs> Barry can't accept death. He's only been the flesh for like eight years. Oh, was it fast enough? I need to run faster. What? Okay, um, we, we need a way to preserve it. What? It's Fahrenheit 451. Black fire. Ray Palmer and I designed it together in collaboration with the foundation that he named after my dad. D did you need to? Okay. Yeah, you didn't say that. Yeah, the, the line was like, if you miss the Armageddon <laughs> event, that's what Ray did. <laughs> Wait, so he can but, turn invisible. So that is a thing. I didn't dream that last time. Yeah, so it isn't just Bart and Nora who can do that. He yeah, can too. Yeah, Bart did it. Oh okay. my god. Fuck this off. creates so many issues. Oh no. And they didn't even need to do it. They could have just had him run fast. Yeah. I triangulated the last few Coast City phantom sightings posted to social media. You're really pulling out all the stops. No, that's basic research. Yeah, that's research. like... <laughs> 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 that is the first step of research. How about you and Barry? You guys know the couple of the century? <laughs> they never <laughs> were. <laughs> I'm personally team Barry and Linda. I'm personally team Barry and his right hand. <laughs> he doesn't even deserve Linda. I mean, but with all that going on, you're still really eager to help this new meta become the streak part two. Is there anything you want to share? Who's this Barry character? Is why a why is, does she have a relationship with Iris? I don't oh, know. Character moment is over. That is yeah. okay. Uh -huh. that yeah, that felt like a Chibno moment where it's like, okay, we're done talking about our feelings. Let's move on. There she is. There she is. That's the one. If they're dangerous, I wouldn't. Oh. There she is. Uh oh, she's got the okay. evil plans. Okay. Uh -oh. Okay. I'm just gonna do this just... out in public. Why? Wait, what did she in check if there everybody. was someone behind her? What she There's that? more people behind her. There oh are people beyond her. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> they are beyond Iris and this lady. Oh my god. Yeah. We were hoping that you could help us with a story that we're researching. Not interested. It's about the Coast City Phantom. Yeah, I'm too busy not being too lazy to open zippers on my backpack. Yeah. All day, Sue. All day. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that okay, that comedic timing was good. Triple espresso. That's a lot of caffeine for a tea. Is it? I drink okay, whatever. Uh, yeah. Teen Street Kid drinks, but yeah. yeah. To survive high school I drink like energy drinks every day. <laughs> but it's not like we have experience working with metas. But is this just the jitter set but with a different coat of paint? It yes. looks the exact same same thing, but this is like supposed to be another city. Oh wait, this isn't this isn't Jitters? No, they're in another city. They're in Coast City. <laughs> oh. Oh, it is. Oh, it is Jitters. Oh, it is a Jitters. It, but it is a Jitters on another. Just, no, it is. Jitters. It is the same chain, I guess. Same set. Good luck finding Mina. 
I would do that to be fair. This iris subplot is so boring. Like I still am so checked out every time they're on screen. I keep working the science. I'm gonna pay Kramer a visit. Now that she's a part of the Wow Barry, you're gonna make him analyze the black fire just because he's black? <laughs> 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 Fucking racist. Scary black fire. Surely you you're gonna use fire. security measures so that you don't get hurt when studying the black fire, right? <laughs> What he heard whispering? Bro, is it whispering at him? Yeah. Ronnie's whispering. He's like, let Ronnie's me out, gonna... Chester. <laughs> yeah, I imagine Ronnie's gonna, like, inhabit his body or some shit. I like how they have basically a PewDiePie chair. I mean, yeah, it's a gamer chair, and he's a live streamer. It's It makes sense. <laughs> oh, yeah. Where he <laughs> makes, like, 30-second live streams. Bro, yeah. where the fuck did it go? <laughs> it's fire. Um, Wait, did it go... Did it get outside of the thing? Burning his what? gamer Ooh, setup. That... <laughs> oh god, that was CGI, okay. yeah. Oh god. Chester. <laughs> this is like Chester. lost Chester CGI. Run. Oh, okay. Really? What the He's fuck? dead! Chester died! Whoa! Well, he... Whoa! <laughs> oh, what? Uh, shame. What? What did it hit then? Yeah, no shit, there's a yes. fire. <laughs> what did it hit if it went directly at him? Bro, what? fucking run! Ah, uh, okay, oh. he was dreamy. Uh, okay. That's even more retarded. <laughs> what the okay, fuck so is you that need irrational it, fear? Need okay? yeah. No, it's not. You had a nightmare. Explain it. Yeah, yeah. I just... Yeah, thank you. It's a bad dream. You sure that's it? Yes, he just woke up. I can feel how frightened you still are. That's yes, how what nightmares do. Yeah. Maybe I just need some coffee to power up the old mental hard drive. No, that's worse. Why won't no. you tell them? How hard is it to just say I had a dream where the fire escaped and it started burning the room? Okay, I can feel him struggling. So you're using it on your friends, but not potential innocents again? Yeah, that's because it's morally correct to use it on your friends, but oh, not. Oh yeah, uh... that's a good point. I didn't think. <laughs> yeah, I will. Huh? Yeah. He'll talk to me. Uh. Yeah, because he's fucking me. Uh, I st I'm still waiting for the scene where they have they play D and D and then they end up fucking and then he leaves oh, to get breakfast. Yeah. Okay, I really need to upgrade my service. What the fuck? No, Sue, we don't have that kind of time. I mean, Tanya can walk through this walls. I mean, she could be. This girl's so cringe. I don't understand why she's here with us. I don't know why she's here either. She's in the comic. She is a major character, but Ralph's been fucked over, so you kind of force her in at random points. She won't tell Barry, but she'll tell Sue. Time sickness. Wait, so she feels Cancer. weird that there's something going on with her that the guy who know who would know way more than her has assured her to just chill out because it's probably nothing. And he has other people who can help. And he found something that he had never seen before. And even though he told me to relax while he looks into it, something is really wrong. And that's why you threw yourself into this Yeah, that's why I went out of town when I'm bit, uh, when I've been losing time. That is a smart idea. Barry's definitely gonna know where to look for me if I just disappear. At first, I was so mad, I just looked the other way. I did everything to avoid facing the consequences of their actions. But I had to stop running away and face my parents. You have to do the same thing. What? I've got this fear around this. This is the worst analogy. Either way, you have to stop running from the fear of the unknown. I don't understand. How is she running? Is it just the idea of like distracting herself? Is that it? Mm. Because like going away or staying in Central City is not gonna change whether or not her sickness is killing her or not. And the still force said it could find her anywhere she was, so I assume it's just to distract herself. Imagine if Iris dies this season. Thank God. She wouldn't. Oh, uh, I think. I Here we go. Wait, did he take the, the fire with him? I thought he left it in the. No, he's keeping a good eye on it. Even D and D talk isn't gonna perk you up. I'm sorry. Ah. Uh. Oh, so no. it's not this episode or they're gonna fuck. Damn it. <laughs> I was also oh. rooting for them, Magic. As our resident science guru, you're in it pretty deep. You have to Now be me pretty deep. <laughs> <laughs> what she's saying is stupid. It's not a lot of pressure because Caitlin also exists and she's there to help them. Like she is the doctor. She's been here and since season one. And they have Cisco they want to help. Oh yeah, Ray as well. He's now in Central City. He's streaming again. Is he? I hope so. It better be a dream. 
I hope it kills Allegra and Chester. <laughs> it didn't oh. trust me! You said the that? Fire, it the didn't fire trust didn't me. trust me. Okay. Kill, kill them too. Kill the both of them. Wait, so how would you put, put it on? Oh my god, it's Ronnie! Jeb, we're gonna see Ronnie! It's oh here. shit. Oh shit. Fire, Wait, doesn't look like I have powers? Here. Oh no, I wanna see Ronnie! Uh, what? Oh, that was useless. Yeah, okay. no shit. It don't work like I that. <laughs> Why did they run towards run the door out. instead of just backing up into the window? Run them out of there. Oh, okay. uh, we didn't oh, get Ronnie. Oh, 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 well, that was a scene. No idea. We what didn't get that. Ronnie. We're gonna get Ronnie by the so end. So it was real. Oh, I guess but the so. fire did trust him. The fire. Okay. <laughs> it's, okay. it's okay. The fire didn't trust him. No, the fire is <laughs> fully out. Stop saying fucking chuck. chuck. We're gonna keep you safe. Chester. Everyone's touch out. Chester, what about your barometric detection thingy? Use the default setting that establishes a tracking grid outside of Star Labs. You retard. Maybe you should check it out. Thanks, Frost. It's like this black fire meta can appear and disappear at random. Plus their fire. Oh, wow. You, you got that like now? Ghost. Oh, no, they're <laughs> really doing it, Jeb. No. Oh it's no, she's running. reading emotions. Again, the breach of ethics. If this meta can get inside Star Labs undetected, they could be anywhere. But uh, no, no. Did you just miss where they made it detected? Oh, the stump bitch. Put Star Labs on lockdown. Nobody except for me gets in or out till we figure out what's going on. That's not gonna stop it. You've just yeah. seen somebody is controlling the fire. Yeah. <laughs> this is stupid. I guess it's better than nothing, but Still, they see it teleport, so... Yeah, I mean, if you can teleport out of that case, I don't understand how we couldn't teleport out of Star Labs, but... Goes through the wall, you could do it. Oh yeah, she can do... She could just, like, put her fingers and burn the lock, so that she can enter. Also, there's literally no one there, and it's less... So, so now she's looking around to see if there's someone, but when she was putting something in her backpack, she did... Oh, she can just walk through things. Yeah. The door is right... Oh, okay. Why did you... Gold face, please appear. <laughs> <laughs> I need you again. <laughs> Good face is gonna have like an end game portal. How did you get in? How? Oh, they. How about oh, so she was just waiting inside. Well, we have friends at Star Labs. When I told them that we had a ghost meta on our hands, they gave me this the molecular destabilizing matrix. All I have to do is turn it on, and it destabilizes. Right. So why doesn't she grab it from her hands? And then radius. she won't. Have in what danger of her powers giving getting fucked. Three blocks. Why didn't they make this device earlier? Uh, that's also a good point. <laughs> I, I'd call that bluff because, like, Poss yeah, possibly, but if it's real, I'm gonna throw a fit. All she has to do is attempt it. Either your way, your whole life was gemmed inside of your backpack. What? How could you say that? You saw a backpack and it wasn't what? even open. What are you talking about, Iris? And that your birth mother worked at that jitters, and that this. Apartment was her last known address. Wait, this is copying yeah, something. My real mom abandoned me when I was born. Your motherless. This, I think, is copying when Iris's mom walked out on their family. You wanted to show your mom what you've become. She's probably dead. Manifested by intense emotion. Check. Let us help you find her. It's fake. Yeah, it was fake. Yeah. Oh, oh, so they're it's just hanging out. Why is Chester so on edge in this episode? I'm very confused. Why is Chester here? Because of the That's... black fire. Like, imagine going, we're gonna have Cisco leave. Because he had to want to. We're gonna replace oh it with Chester. God, they're gonna fuck at the end of this episode. Yeah, they are. <laughs> Let's play some D&D &D to, to take off the edge. <laughs> <laughs> Ronnie. It wasn't some new fire. Ronnie. It was a ghost. Ronnie. You seriously think you're being haunted? By my father. Oh. <laughs> no, it's Ronnie. What? What? I think you're wrong, Chester, but it, it could be your fiery father. auto crash. Wait, so that is why he. So that's so you why when he you was, was like weird when he saw the burnt bodies. He's like, oh, it reminds me of my dad because he died in a fiery car crash, which is like the worst Chester. headline ever, but whatever. Chester, you went and saw your dad in the past before he died, and you got resolution. You you watched that episode as well, Sky. We laughed at it. I did? We did? Yeah. 
it was it was when they went back in uh, time to first deal with Dion. I don't remember that. We said it was one of the worst episodes we've ever seen in anything. I mean, yeah, the first three episodes of season seven are garbage. I think it was episode three. He died alone. Oh. You told that acting, though. Last year when you met. Yeah, see? A good father would not do something like this. I can feel it. Okay? I can, I can feel it. It would be very cheap if it was Ronnie then after all this, wouldn't it? When C.P. Runk loved his son more than anything else. Whatever you felt, thought you saw, it was a lie. <laughs> That's not how you do that. Yeah, chill, Allegra. <laughs> you are a liar. If that was the case, there'd be way more ghosts <laughs> in this retarded show. It is Ronnie. I'm worried. Ronnie. Everyone knows it's Ronnie's show. You don't need to keep pretending it's not. And I got it right from the beginning. Oh, are you, are you actually going to use your powers this time? or? <laughs> Please ban you to death. Oh, uh, Barry, I thought they couldn't get into Star Labs. The lockdown was a very factor. Oh, it's Ronnie. Why does it have to go through the elevator? Which means they can still burn the hell out of us. Turn the walls, too. He's after me. This is all my fault. This is amazing. No, I love this. Not. That was a weird focus point. But we need your help to stop this. Look for anything that could create cold catalyzed reactions. We'll buy you as much time as we can. Okay, the flames are converging on the speed lab. Um, wow, that's CGI done. We'll just stand and walk. Yeah, you're finally gonna do something. I mean, it's cold fusion. I think it's kind of... It's possible. cold. Yeah. Kind of mm -hmm. counterproductive to use cold. Clearly has never played Pokemon before. Not very effective. <laughs> also, like, if it's, like, super hot right now, unless the drill bit is really helping them, they should be dead. Hey, Cecile, what'd you do? Oh, God. She's having an orgasm. Oh, you're, so that means you're Are you doing this with their consent? Yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. Where's the, where's the written consent, huh? <laughs> what is happening? It's not ethical to do this, Cecile. It's Ronnie. Come on, it's gotta it's be Ronnie. Ronnie. It's, it's in be one Ronnie. person. Ronnie. It's Ronnie. It's Ronnie. Oh, it's just some random... Oh. Okay. Oh, it's his dad, okay. It's, it's his dad. <laughs> I thought they were fucking around. It is actually his dad, alright. I'm very... Well, as I said, if it was someone Ronnie, push it the panic be button, go upstairs, or someone push the panic button. Couldn't could he just phase through the floor? Yes. Are they upstairs or downstairs? So it is a shapeshift. Shapeshift. Panic button. Panic button. Panic button. Get the flash in here. I love exposition, don't you? Oh my, oh my god. god, stop with the exposition. <laughs> I hate this show so much. You have to let go of the grief. That's retarded. Oh fuck, it's the, it's Cisco with the fucking box all over again from season three. I don't remember what Panic button, push your phone! <laughs> what is Barry and Caitlin doing right now? Being killed by the flames? Yes. I remember him burning alive in the car in that grass. I love you. Oh, <laughs> fuck off. I mean, you can't this figure Get just lie to you and be like, I love you, son. And then, <laughs> yeah, These people it. aren't doing anything either. Put, like, move. Stop Chester. Move him. Don't <laughs> just look at him. <laughs> Allegra, you have powers. Get the fucking Flash. Oh, n never mind. Oh, the power of flashback. Will is going to save him. Oh, yeah, flashbacks. Just to accentuate how emotional it always is. Okay, yeah. Also, this isn't a flashback, it's him imagining what he, his parents, what his father would say about his life. Oh, isn't it so sad? It is very sad. What? Okay, so the grief part has to have a part in Ronnie. Okay. <laughs> They're gonna do it. They're gonna do that. So I'm gonna add something to this theory. What if his grief of not being able to be with Caitlyn, and he dies, 
is like the key driving force for this Ronnie. So why don't you just go to hell? <laughs> 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 but like, okay, like that's how Ronnie becomes that Ronnie. That's literally like, all he had. Oh, so they were like there the Greek... just like vibrating. Yes, like they the were just standing of... there the whole time. Yeah. Fuck. Like the grief of Ronnie one creates this Ronnie who's really evil and just wants Caitlyn. I'm. That's my theory. If I'm right, I'm gonna cry of laughter. Well, what was the lesson here? He just learned that he has friends that he loves. He learns that his he father was someone that was a part of his life. He learns so that woke on woke crime is a myth. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they could have done a bit more than you already did, look like but one. if you say so. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> you shouldn't be laughing, but that was funny. Fiance and childhood sweetheart to cancer. Uh oh, they got him. Ah, uh, they're gonna do it. The black next fire episode, has consumed Next Jed. episode is gonna have Caitlyn as the focus. Oh my god. And that's why they established that she, she still feels grief over Ron, Ronnie the in episode one. And Ronnie the eater feels grief. grief. And Ronnie feels grief over her, and that grief has made this Ronnie, and that's why they're being attracted. Oh Boom. Boom. It's happening. <laughs> oh my god, the grief has been travelling however many years of this show to make this Ronnie. And all it- Determination, to passion, to desire, oh my god, this is 100% Ronnie. to go to Ronnie. hell. Yeah, that's also hilarious. It's got a mind of its own. Oh my god. The will to seek out victims to kill? To satisfy its hunger at all costs? Flames have a survival instinct. Means the flames aren't being used by the killer. They are the killer. God, I love that cliche. Because they're Whoa. Whoa, no shit, Chester. Whoa. Tense music. Where is Iris, by the way? Are we gonna cut back to her before the episode ends? Probably. She's probably gonna get bad news or something. Come on, pl go play D&D with Allegra. We need it. Not... Clap her cheeks. <laughs> Could be a threesome <laughs> as well. <laughs> Just see her cheating but on that... Joe just to make Chester happy. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot she was with Joe. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder why Allegra's into Chester. He's a. <laughs> There's a lot of racist jokes this guy's gonna have to cut out. Go play D and D. Ah, uh, she's gonna. Bro, uh, bro, why are you off, reading the emotion? Yeah, invasion that's, of privacy. Secondly, really she just noticed that the two of them were horny. To leave and now, come on, D and D. Say, oh, it. let's let's go shit. play some D and D, girl. <laughs> yes, D and D. Wait. Oh, if she can't? kills people. No, wait, 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 wait. wait. People... I don't give a shit. We got an interesting question about Cecile. Oh, if she feels people getting horny, does she too get horny? I don't think she gets horny. I think Maybe. she just you know, needs the emotions. She doesn't does... feel them. It's not like. Maybe uh, she went to go find Joe. That's why she left. Exactly. Oh yeah, <laughs> but yeah. So they're go so they're fucking on this this Saturday, I guess, because they they said we're gonna pull an all nighter. So that's the one. Ah, uh. an all nighter on this day. <laughs> <laughs> oh well. Interracial. Hey, Iris. Welcome, welcome. Okay, Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna lose time again, just for for us to remember. Uh -oh. oh yeah, she does have TV. Told you, Dion. Cancer. Bad news. Oh shit. Cancer. Who would have oh, seen my. this coming? I did see it coming. I, for one, am shocked. The Flash has baboozled me again. It's so fun. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, that was episode nine. Yeah, episode nine. Yeah, that wasn't even a gold face episode. Yeah, I'm disappointed. <laughs> I mean, that no, episode... it wasn't, but. That was just like a really boring episode. That, I don't know. It I, happened. I, I don't have much to say. It's like, yeah, that was an episode we watched. Nah. At least it had one funny moment. Yeah. <laughs> like one very funny moment. Yeah. Just don't like what I didn't even talk. They're, well, they, they, they set it up. They're, so that's, that's a start. Yeah, hopefully. maybe when we start this episode, they've already fucked. Because usually they keep a consistent of like each episode is said oh, come on. every week. 
Well, they already had the the future scenes in Armageddon to establish how they fuck and what happens in that moment. We don't need to see the leading up to it because of the dialogue there already implies that they'd fuck that Saturday, so yeah. But I'm down bad. <laughs> you need to see Allegra's cheeks. I need I need to see some actual porn on the CW. <laughs> <laughs> Oh fuck! I gotta download the next episode. Yeah, I will. Wow, it's I massive. also gotta do something for for a minute, so I'll be right back. You still have a per episode lever? I have. It's there. What are you talking about? Where? In the fucking uh folder. Are you blind? Oh. Well, I haven't looked at the folder because <laughs> I didn't realize you put it in the folder. Wait, what did you expect me to put it? It's like, oh, you still I haven't put episode you... 11. It's... I expected where, where you else to would send you be the looking? folder. What? I expected you to send the folder in here once it was done. Like a where normal did I? I told you before done. we started recording. Oh, I had already finished uploading. Why would I send it again? You already have the folder. Send No, you send it each time. Why would so I send the folder each time? It's <laughs> pinned. I don't have to. I didn't know it was pinned. So you that's why pinned you it. To. <laughs> and that shows how attentive I am. Man, you have some brain damage, I swear to God. Anyway, I'll be right back. Give me a minute. And if anyone can um get Ten to appear, I'd appreciate it. No, not after this. You've betrayed me. <laughs>